What's up everybody, my name is Mr. Fragrance, I'm back with another fragrance review. If it's your first time on this channel, welcome. I appreciate it a lot. Thanks for clicking on my video. If you like men's fragrance reviews, if you like men's fragrance opinions, if you like free men decan giveaways, you click to the right channel. So if you like these type of videos, hit the like button, click the subscribe button at the end of the video. If you like this kind of content, share the video with friends and families. So the first video was a little bit too long. I apologize for that. I'm going to try to make this one a little bit lower. But anyway, this is my top. 14 cheap fragrances. So all these fragrances are about under $100 or close to 100 bucks. I know a lot of people don't have a lot of money these days to buy fragrances, so I'm just trying to cut the list down. Really cheap fragrances. So if you like these type of videos, stay tuned. So this is part one of my top 14 cheap fragrances. So if you haven't seen part two, there's a link below. You can click that video first. I don't want you guys to get mixed up. But we're going to get right into it, guys. This is my number seven on my top cheap fragrance list. This fragrance is great. I bought it for two people in my life. One of my friends I work with, co-workers, for Christmas. And another friend, of my brother Matthew, as a gift. And they both like it. They've got compliments galore on this fragrance. It kind of hasn't been talked about a lot in the community. Just because the funny bottle shape and the name really kind of doesn't really... It's hard to pronounce. It's kind of weird. doesn't make sense with the with everything, but I'm gonna get right to it. This is Imperio Armani, Stronger With You. This fragrance is great. I got it for 50 bucks at Sephora. Very great fragrance, very hidden gem. It gets compliments, it's great. Has your pineapple, has your pink pepper, has your sage, has your vanilla. This fragrance is great. And no, it does not smell anything like Invictus. I just wanna put that out right now before people start saying, oh, the pineapple has Invictus, it doesn't. That's just Get that out the way right now. Great smelling fragrance. I get the vanilla and I get the pineapple in it when I smell it. It's just a very pleasant, very sweet, sweet, sweet fragrance. I tend to like this a lot. The price is $50 for this bottle here. Not the biggest bottle in the world, but man, it's great. The only thing I don't really like about it and a lot of people complain about is this cap. It doesn't, you gotta get it on there. It doesn't go on right. It's just so weird. I don't understand why they didn't make it where just magnetic this clap on and off but anyway this fragrance is very great it smells great projection wise i get between an hour and a half to two hours very great i feel, feel like it projects a lot more because people around me still smell it after like the first two three hours like oh man i still they still smell it, which is great i don't really smell it as much but they do so that's awesome longevity wise they get between six seven hours on my skin pretty good 50 bucks for this isn't bad, especially if you don't have a lot of money, you're on a tight budget trying to buy fragrances. So I'm trying to give you these fragrances that are under 100 bucks so you can buy maybe one or maybe two of them for about 100 bucks and you can rest assured you'll be happy with these fragrances you purchase. And this is my number seven, Stronger With You by Aperio Amar. Great bottle presentation, distribution. It smells really good. Cap is kind of weird, but it snaps on. So this is my number seven, top cheap fragrance. Now we're gonna jump into my number six, top cheap fragrance. So we're gonna jump into my top six cheap fragrance. Here we go. It's been around for a while, I like it. You call, people mostly say it smells like bubble gum. I get that, and I'm gonna get right to it. This can be for teenagers or older men that wanna wear it. You can wear it to the club, you can wear it casual if you want. It just smells like bubblegum to me, and most people around me smell bubblegum. And this is my number six, Paco Rabanne Invictus. Just a regular Invictus. And it's great. I like it. Distribution is good. It's kind of weird how it sprays. I click, click in it, but it works. This is Invictus, the original. It's awesome. I like the bottle presentation by Paco Rabanne. It smells like bubblegum. That's what people typically people say. It's pretty good on my skin. Uh, it's it's about that hour projection wise longevity I get about six seven hours not the best but it's pretty good the price point for this isn't bad neither you're paying about sixty seven dollars for this bottle so about under seventy bucks some people just just want something like sweet some people don't want the fresh and clean fragrances so if you want something different in your collection if you like nothing like this I suggest you should try out Invictus by Paco Rabanne. It's a great fragrance. Like I said, it's about $67 of tax. It might be like a couple of hours, over $70, maybe $72, $73. You should try this out. They have it at Macy's, Sephora, Nordstrom, 
So I highly suggest you should pick this, pick this one up or just try it out for yourself and see if you like it. And this is my number six top cheap fragrance. Now we're gonna get into my number five top cheap fragrance. So my number five top cheap fragrance is another one by, another one by Paco Rabanne. It's great, I like it. I never had the original, so I can't go off that one. So I'm just gonna go off this one here, and this is number five, Invictus Aqua 2018. Great, great fragrance. This is your, feels like you're at the ocean, boom, right in your face. This is your beach type of fragrance. It's overall great. I can see people wearing this in the spring, summer, you know, maybe the cool, you know, just, just overall great fragrance. You can't go wrong, it's about $67 for this bottle here. I like it. I wish I would have tried out the original Invictus Aqua, but I couldn't get my hands on it. It was about $150 to $170 for a bottle on eBay. That's a lot. I do, down the road, I hope I do get a chance to buy it for maybe around $100 and something, but $150 is a lot of money for a fragrance. And I do have a lot of fragrances in my collection, as you guys can see in all the videos that I make. <laughs> but this one is very great. I enjoy it a lot. This is Invictus Aqua 2018. It's amazing, just fresh ocean right in your face it's just just a very cool summer type of vibe fragrance you can't go wrong with this fragrance here i get about an hour and a half projection wise on my skin it's pretty good longevity i get about six hours six and a half on my skin it's pretty good i like it i got a few comments with it not crazy comments but they're pretty good you should try this one out if you're looking for something mainly for the warmer months maybe not the fall months but the warmer months like september I'm sorry, <laughs> like June, July, and August, and maybe the, the first week or so in September. Pretty good, this is a great fragrance. You should give this one a try. Plus it's under 70 bucks. So this is Invictus Aqua 2018. Now we're gonna jump into my number four top cheap fragrance, so stay tuned. So my number four top cheap fragrance is, it's up there, it's around 80 something bucks. It's not 100, so it's not too bad. I like the brand a lot. At first, I didn't like the brand of their fragrances because some of them were really in high upscale prices. I tried this one out. I got it on sale a couple months ago at Macy's, but now it's about $80 now. You should try this out. It's a very fresh, clean vetiver fragrance, and this is no other than Tom Ford Gray Vetiver EDT. This fragrance is great, man. I, I talk about this one a lot on my channel. It's just fresh, it's clean. It's the Mr. Clean Guy. That's it. There's nothing more to it. There's no like wow factor like Dior Sauvage or Blue de Chanel. This is just a typical clean, nice guy. Smell, you smell clean, pleasant. You're not gonna offend anybody. This is great. I like the cap, it's kind of cool. It slides right on. Distribution is great. Just great, just clean. You, Mr. Clean, that's all it is. It's a very clean fragrance. You jump out the shower, you spray it on, and you can go for the day. You know you're gonna be clean. You know you're gonna be just you're not gonna offend anybody. You can go out today, do your errands, go to work. If you got if you go on vacation, you can wear this. It's not gonna hurt, it's not gonna offend anybody in the hot weather or the cold weather. It's just great. Projection wise, I get about two hours on my skin. It's good. People do like it. I got a few compliments here and there, not many. It's not a compliment getter. If you if you ask what you're looking for it, then no. Uh, longevity, I get about seven hours on my skin, pushing about seven hours, which is awesome. Especially with a fragrance like this. Uh, I got it for I got mine for under eighty bucks, but you can get it for about eighty to eighty eight dollars for this fragrance at Macy's, Macy's.com, Macy's store, or you pick it up at Nordstrom or Sephora. They do have the EDT like this, and they do have the EDP. So either one you might like. The EDP seems more feminine to me on my skin, but you can try them both out for yourself and see which one you like. This is just a recommendation. So this is my number four, Tom Ford Gray Vetiver EDT. Now we're gonna jump into my number three, top cheap fragrance. Down to my top three cheap fragrances. This one's great. Another one by Paco Rabanne. Pop, Paco Rabanne fragrances out left and right here, guys. <laughs> so we get right to it. My number three is Paco Rabanne, One Million Lucky. I like this fragrance a lot. It's great. The bottle presentation is amazing. Sorry for the glares. You know, look at it. Use a lot of juice already. Just great overall. I enjoy this one a lot. Bottles just so shiny it messes up the light. <laughs> but this fragrance is great. Juice wise, look at the color of that, the back of it. 
This fragrance is a great sweet gourmand type of fragrance. Your fresh, your sweet type of fragrance. I got the, you get your plum, you get your hazelnut, you get your honey in this. And with initial spray, when you spray this, I just smelled hazelnut and that just boom in your face. This is a great fragrance, so be easy on the trigger. Maybe like three sprays. Don't go four or five. Don't go crazy. You might get some people headed with this fragrance. It's very, very sweet. Projects very strong for the first two hours. Longevity wise, I get eight hours, so it gets you to work day. Maybe even more sometimes. But this fragrance will get you to the work day. It's a great fragrance. You can get it for this bottle here for $88 at Macy's or Sephora. Or you can get the small bottle, it's about this size, my fingers right here, for about 67, almost 70 bucks for 1.7. Can't go wrong with that. You should, if you like sweet fragrances, like a gourmand type of fragrance, you should check this one out. And this is Paco Rabanne, 1 million lucky. Now we're gonna jump into my top two cheap fragrances. Oh, my number two top cheap fragrance, I love this fragrance a lot. I will talk about this fragrance on my channel as long as I'm still living and doing YouTube videos. This fragrance is great. The brand itself is great. I have the other the original and I have the flanker and this one is maybe not a flanker. This is kind of different, more of a summer type of vibe. I like it. You can call it kind of sweet like your Invictus Aquas. But I like it a lot. My number two top cheap fragrance is Aqua de Gio. Absolute. I love this fragrance a lot. I enjoy it. I should have bought a bigger bottle. This reminds me of Invictus Aqua 2018. If you want to compare the two, very similar to this. This one is just, this one lasts more on my skin better. If you're looking for an alternative, if you don't want to get Invictus Aqua 2018, you should try this one out. This is very great. You know, it has that typical little bit of the DNA of the Giorgio Armani Profumo, but no, this is very different. This is more of your sweet, your summer type of vibe fragrance. I like it a lot. Projection-wise, I get two hours of very strong projection on my skin. People do notice I've gotten a few comments wearing this. I use pretty much a good bit of the juice already, you can tell. If I knew it was going to be this great, I would have just went, like the sales rep told me, just buy the $130 bottle, but I was being stupid at the time. I said, oh, I'm going to save money and get the smaller bottle. This bottle here is $95, but you can get a smaller bottle or uh, 1.7 ounce bottle. This is a 2.5 ounce, 2 ounce bottle. You can get a 1.7 ounce bottle for about $72 at Sephora. This bottle here, I got this one for $95 at Macy's. And then I have a bigger bottle for $130. This fragrance is great. You know, very gr great summer type of fragrance. You can probably wear it all year round too. I mean, you wear your fragrance whenever you want to wear your fragrances. You know, I'm just giving suggestions and recommendations. I like this fragrance a lot. If you want something similar to Invictus Aqua, which you don't want Invictus Aqua 2018, you should definitely give this a try out. This is very great. This came out this year, the 2018 fragrance. And this, and I highly recommend you try this one out. I will hype this one up for a while because I do enjoy wearing it. Some people might like it, some people may not like it at all. So this is my number two top cheap fragrance. Giorgio Armani Aqua Di Gio Absolute. Now we're going to jump into my number one top cheap fragrance. So now we're getting to my number one top cheap fragrance. This fragrance is great. Price for it $69.99. You get a bigger bottle for $89.99. At first I didn't like this fragrance. And I said in other videos too, it's okay. Then I worn a lot more. Like other fragrance people say, try the fragrance out more and see if you like it. Most likely you probably will gravitate to it more. And I've worn a lot more now and I enjoy it. It's very pleasing. People do like it. I've gotten a few comments, not a lot. I do enjoy wearing this. This is your spring summer type of fragrance. I can't see this in the winter time really, but I do like it a lot. And it's from the house of John Barbados. And they make good fragrances. Most of them don't project good on my skin or longevity wise, which is pretty sad, but I do like them all. I like Dark Rebel. Very great fragrance. And Dark Rider. I like them both. One with the leather on both sides with the keys. I like them both. But anyway, let's get right to it. John Barbados, Artist and Pure. This fragrance is great. It's great. This is a fresh, this is your citrus type of fragrance. This is what I smell when I initial smell of it. People around me smell it. So this is just great. If you want something fresh, clean, fragrance, John Barbados Artisan Pure. Can't go wrong with this fragrance here. You can wear it dressed up or a dress down. This is a great fragrance. It's $69.99. Great fragrance. You should highly try this out at Macy's, Sephora, or Nordstrom. 
is this fantastic fragrance. At first, I didn't like it. I thought it wasn't even worth it, my time. Then I bought it, and I started to like it more after wearing it four to five times during the week on my skin. And I enjoy it. I like it a lot. I enjoy it. This is a $69.99 uh, bottle right here. We do have an $89 bottle, too, a little bit bigger. This is great. If you're looking for just something fresh, your citrus sign, a clean base fragrance, this is it. John Barbados. Artist and Pure. It's $69. I have to put fragrances like this on the list because they're under $100. And most of these fragrances that I put on my list, I wear them all. Some get compliments, some don't. But I do enjoy this one a lot. And I highly recommend you should try this fragrance out since it's number one on the list. And this is John Barbados Artist and Pure. $69.99. All right, thank you guys for watching my videos. I put a lot of videos out. I put a lot of content out. I appreciate you guys for staying tuned every week. I appreciate every subscriber that I do have on my channel. If you are a lady or a gentleman and you like my type of fragrance videos, please like the video, share the video with friends and families. If you really like my videos a lot, please hit, click the subscribe button. It shows me that you guys continue to like my content. And I can post more content out each and every day or every other day. Thanks for watching this video. I apologize if it's too long, just like part two of my top 10, top 14 fragrances. And have a nice day.